We may live with our friends, we may live without books, but civilised man cannot live without cooks. Nesmuk, Woodcraft, 1884. As you've probably sussed out with the Dutch oven, a bit of camp cooking today. So we're going to cook up some good scran, some good Lancashire scran for a Lancashire lad. And uh, it's a bit of a skanky wet day, and uh, it's been raining non-stop as it has everywhere, hasn't it? Really for uh, all week. So everything's soaking wet through. So not the best day for sparking fire up. The, uh, not the best day for cooking with a Dutch oven really. All the wood's sort of skanky wet. We're not in an ideal forest. We're better with an hardwood type forest, but uh, it'll be alright. It'll do the job. So uh, stick with us and see what we're cooking up. First job, let's get a brew on. Need a brew, don't you? As soon as that fire's going, you need a good brew. Alright, let's get a brew on. So there we are, that's our ingredients. We've got some lamb, I'm using minced lamb today. We've got some Worcester sauce, potatoes, carrots, onions, and uh, we've got some stock there, and a little bit of uh, flour some pepper, some salt, and a little bit of cooking oil. And that's going to do us the job, I reckon. We'll get it over that good little fire in a minute once that brew's made. First job, let's get a bit of oil heated up. Oh, bring that up a bit. We'll get that cast iron heated up a little bit. Right. That oil's hot enough. We'll get a bit of veg in. Get that for a sizzle. Quite a bit of veggie. I'm gonna brown that off. Well, we should soften it up. Get a bit of meat on now. We'll get that browned up. A little bit more oil in. And we'll soon have that all browned up. Right, so we're rocking and rolling. <clears throat> right, let's get a couple of tablespoons of uh, flour in there, at least. Let's 
sorrel up. This is just going to thicken it up a bit. So I'll be putting some uh, some water in and what have you. Give that a good give that a good stir around. Nice. That's it, give that a good stir, cover that, <coughs> soaked it up already that, <coughs> put my veg in, look at that, all those lovely uh, softened uh, onions and carrots there, get all them in. Get all that mixed up again. Looking good. Looking good. Right, let's get a couple of good glugs of uh, Worcester sauce in. That'll do. We'll have. Uh, Right, let's have a look. Whoa. I'm used to me stock cues, me, that's not crumbling up right well, but anyway. Here, get that crumbled up. Get a bit of water in, 500ml of water. That's going to do with to a stock. a good mix around. We're going to simmer that for a bit. Look at that. Now that's looking like a good uh, pile of grub that. Let's get that simmering. I'll go and find some more firewood in a minute. But first I think I'll was a bit of a bit of salt and pepper on top of that. Let's pop the lid on for a little bit. I'll let that do its bit do its thing yeah. Nearly messed up there, nearly forgot the bay leaf. Hey, eh? crumple that up. Oh. I'll chuck the bay leaf in there, shove that on top there. Yeah. Looking good. Oh look at that, that's lovely isn't it? I'm going to line that <coughs> with sliced potatoes. So all these potatoes that I've just sliced are covering all the way around the... You don't mind a bit of dirt do we eh? It'll be right when it's cooked up. Bastard. I said a bit of dirt. Don't mind a bit. All the way around. And then we'll get it back on the on the coals. We'll get some coals on top of this as well. Bits and pieces of coals, bring some of them coals over here. Yep. I'm gonna set that set that down on them coals there. Yeah. And I'm gonna get some more bits and pieces on top. Get some coals up here.
one of my oldest spoons there. This had some serious ammo. And the newest one that I started making last week. Just finishing it off. Well, yeah, I should mention the Scottish Charity Adventure again. Yeah, check out let me last video a few weeks back if you've not seen it before. But we're setting off on an adventure to Scotland to raise money for cancer research, which is somewhat close to my heart, yeah, as well as a lot of other people's. So if you fancy sponsoring us or whatever, there's a Just Giving page in the description of the video. And, uh, yeah, anything else, be great to, you know what I mean, to have your help along that one if you can. But uh, no worries if not, but thanks for joining me on this vid anyway. Fantastic to be out in the woods as usual. We love it, don't we? bushcrafting, cooking, wildlife photography, adventuring, whatever we're doing. It's just great to be outside in it. Fantastic. Right. So I reckon we're looking pretty good now. I reckon it's going to be pretty damn ready to rock and roll. Get these enemies off. Woo, get it out at fire. Oh, that's it. Whoosh. Oh, right, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh. Oh yeah, that's looking nice. Look at that. That is looking pretty good. Let me get a fork. A little bit crispy out outside, but I don't mind that. Mmm. Lovely. Look at that. That is looking good. Right, for a proper taste test. Whoa, that's lovely that. <coughs> so, Lancashire hot pot in the forest. Brilliant. So if you've never tried it, have a go. Another great camp recipe. Great for being out with a group. Great for on your own. Great to share with your dog, Billy. Well, yeah. Fantastic. So thanks for joining us in the forest anyway. It's been a cracking day out here. Good to cook up a bit of food and chill out a bit. I'll get rid of that bay leaf. And uh, so yeah, so we're gonna have a couple of brews, eat this good scram, and chill out and enjoy the forest. We'll say thanks for joining us, and we'll catch you again real soon. All right, see you later. Ta-da.